Hey everyone, it's Billy the bartender from Better Roads. It's springtime, and that means it's a great time to get outdoors and really celebrate nature. And what a better way to do that than with non-alcoholic gin cocktails. Today, I'm gonna walk you through how to make two amazing non-alcoholic gin cocktails with the award-winning Bax Botanics brand. If you like bold botanical flavors with a crisp finish, you're gonna love the Bax Botanics Verbena Spirit. And if you love brands that really take nature seriously, I mean all the way from the production process of sourcing the right organic fair trade ingredients through to packaging, you're gonna love the Bax brand. All right, with that, let's get back to the bar and make those cocktails. Bax Botanic Spirits are proudly designed by nature and pay homage to the ingredients used from sourcing organic and ethically grown botanicals to using sustainable and recycled materials during production. Everything is designed by nature with the idea of inspiring a connection with the natural world. So much so that the design of the label, get this, is a microscopic image of a plant. All right. Today, I'm gonna to walk you through how to make two tasty, non-alcoholic cocktails that are perfect for the springtime. Today, we are featuring the non-alcoholic Bax Botanic Verbena Spirit, which is perfect for these cocktails because the Verbena Spirit is rich in botanicals, but has a nice crisp finish. Today, we are going to be making the simple cucumber g and and a little more complex drink, the Bee's Knees, which is a Prohibition era style cocktail, and it is a shaken drink. So with that, let's get started. And just remember, if I can do it, you can do it. Let's get to it. Here's what you need. Bax Botanics, non-alcoholic Verbena Spirit, two to three ounces, Collins glass with ice, tonic, half a lime, cucumber slice, simple lime rind garnish. Now pour the Bax Verbena Spirit into the Collins glass with ice, add tonic, squeeze half a lime into the glass. With a cocktail stirring spoon, place cucumber slice on the inside of the Collins glass. Now you can do this before you add the ice too, whatever works for you. Just add the lime rind garnish, stir in the glass, and enjoy your cucumber g and tea. All right, here's what you need. Bax Botanics, non-alcoholic verbena spirit, two to three ounces, a coupe cocktail glass, a shaker, a whole lemon cut in half, ice, quarter ounce of honey, and for the flying bee lemon garnish, you're gonna need a lemon rind, two dried cherries, and a cocktail stir stick. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna make our flying bee lemon garnish. So let's cut a lemon wedge from a whole lemon, scrape out the pulp, cut an oval shape with pointed ends, Cut a slit down the middle and on each side of for three slits. Bend the lemon rind in half, place one cherry on a stir stick and push the stick through the lemon rind and place the other cherry on the other side of the lemon rind. Push out the lemon rind on each side to create your bee wings. And buzz buzz, you have your flying bee lemon garnish. Okay, time to make the Bee's Knees Cocktail. Pour the Bax Verbena Spirit into the cocktail shaker. Squeeze the fresh lemon into the shaker. Add the ice. Pour in the honey. Now shake it. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. Strain into a coupe cocktail glass. Add your flying bee garnish and enjoy. Cheers, everyone! You can find all of these tasty alcohol-free products at betterroads.com.